Hey, this is Jimmy. Who is this? Jimmy. This is former New Jersey Governor Chris Christie. <laughs> oh, my God. I don't know. What? <laughs> you people, heard me. Do people remember... Uh, but wh- why are you calling after all these years, Chris? <laughs> because I'm about to announce my candidacy for president. <laughs> I'm relevant again. I'm in the fucking news over here. <laughs> <laughs> but your voice. What about my voice? <laughs> what about your voice? <laughs> Fuck your eyes. <laughs> When did the Sopranos go off the air again? Just remind me when the Sopranos went off the air again. What difference does it make when it went off the air? <laughs> it's still available on streaming services. <laughs> it's being rediscovered by younger generations. There's still a robust online discussion about the show and its legacy. It's a beloved cultural touchstone that still resonates to this day, you fucking funnel. <laughs> okay, settle down. Kiss my front butt. Governor, <laughs> Governor Christie, please. Maybe this is just how I talk. Do you ever think of that? <laughs> yeah, b- but it's not, though. Maybe it's just a really inaccurate impression that sounds <laughs> like a totally other guy as a coincidence. Okay, maybe. <laughs> and another thing. Isn't this funnier? <laughs> isn't this funnier than how he really talks? I mean, come on. Really? Really? (laughs) Okay, fine. Okay, good. (laughs) (laughs) I don't want any beef with you, Jimmy. We can't move forward with any beef. Are we good? Yes, we're good, Governor Christie. No beef. <laughs> God, I'm so fucking hungry right now. <laughs> oh, brother. Wow, of course there's going to be fat jokes. <laughs> All right, can we at least have a serious conversation about the 2024 race? <laughs> Jesus yeah. Christ. Is... <laughs> sure, of course, whatever you want. We'll talk about whatever you want. That's what I'm paying you for, right? Paying me? Sorry, I got you confused with somebody else. Yeah, the Republican field is getting pretty full as we speak. What sets you apart from your competitors? Because I'm the only one who's not going to pussyfoot around Trump. Everyone else is going to pussyfoot. I'm not going (laughs) to (laughs) pussyfoot. You're not going to beat Trump unless you take Trump head on. Hit him hard. Hit him where he works, where he sleeps, where he eats. Hit him at the tanning salon when he least expects it. I see. I'm not afraid of him. Fuck him. Are you sure? <laughs> Are you sure you're really in a great position to challenge him after endorsing him twice, working for him, and being publicly tossed aside and humiliated by him? Come on, Jimmy. Why you gotta say that? Because it's true. I gotta be tough over here. I gotta look <laughs> tough. I gotta talk a bunch of shit about him. Knowing full well I'll fold like a pool chair the second he challenges me or calls me chub chubby or whatever (laughs) (laughs) well then how are you going to handle being on a debate stage with them Eh, let's be honest this probably isn't going to get that far that then why are you doing this attention wow (laughs) really (laughs) <laughs> I mean, mainly, yeah. But it could go further. Who knows? I get to look tough. I'll be tougher than Mike Pence. That's for fucking sure. I'll bully some of the other candidates, the ones I can get away with. Uh, maybe some regular citizens, too. And then once I drop out, I can write a book called Tough Talk by Chris Christie or some shit. Retire a millionaire. How inspiring. Just a simple kid from New Jersey who had a simple dream (laughs) to absolutely fuck up traffic one day over a petty dispute 
and then run for president twice unsuccessfully, only to be humiliated by a charlatan. <laughs> <laughs> and believe me, I've almost accomplished them all. Well, I certainly would buy your book. Really? Absolutely not, Chris. All right, I don't need this. <laughs> I don't need this fucking abuse. I could go home and get this kind of abuse from Calm if I wanted. <laughs> <laughs> Chris, you're not Tony Soprano. I don't know who I am anymore, Jimmy. <laughs> I'm confused. I'm lost. I'm hungry. <laughs> All the fucking time. I need to do some soul searching. For real this time. I mean it. Maybe speak in your real voice? Fuck that. That's the last <laughs> thing I'm going to do. I'm going to call you every week and talk to you in this voice. You like that hot shot? <laughs> How do you like that hot shot? <laughs> Feel tough now, hot shot? Hot shot. <laughs> okay, I'm done. Goodbye. Hey, everybody. Only $10 to go see my new stand-up special, COVID Lies Are Funny, at JimmyDoor.com. And come see us do a live show. We're going to be in Coho's, New York, Hartford, Connecticut, Bakersfield, California, Baltimore, San Francisco, Huntington Beach, Rosemont, and Chicago, Las Vegas, Salt Lake City, and more. We're going to be in New York, Stamford, Connecticut, Pottstown, Pennsylvania, San Diego, everywhere. Go to JimmyDoor.com for a link for all our tickets.